Looking down off the mountain slope And there's my steps Echo, echo Louder than before Another day is done Say goodbye to the setting sun See what I found Turn back to the ground Just like before Hey, 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 beautiful day, hey, hey, beautiful day. This is Ruth Perry, and I'm 11 years old. And my name is Maria, I'm 17 years old. My name is Laura Dukin. I'm Sophie, and I'm just here. My name is Sam Williams. My name is Olivia. This is Ricardo Seaman. I live in Hampton, and I'm 13 years old. Hello, my name's Jack Stanford. Hello, my name's Jack. My name's Owen. Um, and my name's Charlotte. I've been going to different youth clubs and projects for about four years. So when the opportunity to volunteer for the Hangleton and Noel project came along, I was really happy to get involved. I attend Young Women's Group on every Monday night at uh, St Richard. Um, I do other with the youth project as well. Part of the Young Women's Group and Children's County Conference. I have done the rock climbing, sports day, graffiti, with Hangleton and Noel. What have you done in Hangleton and Noel project? I have done a lot of trips and activities with the Hangleton and Noel project, like rock climbing, abseiling, graffiti, football, and lots of other stuff. How are you involved in the Hangleton and Noel project? Well, when I was about 10 years old, the Hampton Mail Project was sending letters to every kid in the estate and um, and my mum told me that I have a letter in the post so I got really excited. I went down to see what it was and it said um, there was there was youth trips going on in the area so I went, so I, um, I asked my mum if I could go down to church and see what was going on and I've joined, been part of it since I was 10. It was a good community fun day at the park when there was a radio ball and a barbecue. Lots of kids were having fun and everyone was getting on. Decent music in the background and it's good that youth workers put themselves out for activities for young children and like it to happen again. It was good. I wanted to be involved because I wanted to work with children and young people but also because the workers have always given me a lot of time and patience so I wanted to give them to others and I love tea and biscuits. Basically I'm involved because my mate woke me up early one morning and called me up and was like, do you want to come to Blackman's Farm with me with the Hankton Knoll project? I was like, yeah I might as well and then ever since then I've been like involved basically. I am involved because I like to make new friends in Hankton and have new skills to help you in the future. Why are you involved in the Hamilton and Noel project? I am involved because I like to hang out with my friends and make new friends. Also, to learn to learn skills I could use in later life. I'm involved in the Hamilton and Noel project by going to the activities they put on and like help out with the organising the trips and asking them what the, what other people would like to do in the trips. We're all part of the Hangleton and Noel Project Children Can Do. And our group name is Fun Rules. Uh, uh, over, the, over the past few months we've been involved with Children Can Do, which is also part of Hangleton and Noel Project. And, uh, the reason why we did this because in the summer holiday there wasn't really enough activities so we managed to get a £1,907.50 from Children Can Do. Why are you involved? Well, since the recession's going on, a lot of stuff isn't affordable nowadays so the trips are usually on average about £5. That's, that's probably the most expensive. So. Yeah, you go buy one of the tickets, you get to go on an expensive trip for a cheaper price, and also fun. The project made such a big impact in my life, I suppose. I kind of want to be able to do the same back, um, and if it means 
I get to have fun along the way, then it's all good. <laughs> I, uh, I guess I enjoy doing it. I do it for fun, uh, to try and help the community, uh, and I guess to try and make my CV look good, which is probably a tad bit selfish, but hey ho. It's been a lot of fun volunteering with the project but also it's given me the confidence boost and the maturity to work with young people and people in general. Um, I've got more friends and more relationships with, like better relationships with people and I've also got a bronze art school. On the panel I've learnt how to make decisions about giving funding to different groups and projects. Also, how to grade funding applications and choose how money is spent. I've learned to be more sociable because on the trips you spend you spend time with people all day. You get to know them, you get to know things about them, you make friends, and I don't know. It just makes you more confident when you're more sociable. I don't know. I think I've probably learned quite a lot, mainly because um, I was so young when I first was involved in the project. So I don't know. I've probably grown in confidence and my people skills have got a lot better because of the project so you know I've developed more as a person and I think I've become completely different outfields of the project so you know it's all good. And I guess I've learned over the last few years well I had to be a better role model towards young people try and change myself a little bit to be more professional so that I don't come across as a bit of an immature twit. I look forward to working with the Hangton Null Project in the future and think they're a really good organisation. Thanks. Thank you, Hamilton Law Project. Thank you, Hamilton Law Project. Thank you to the Hamilton Law Project and all the people involved, making it fun for everybody. Thank you, Hamilton Law Project. Thank you to the Hamilton Law Project. Yeah, I'll try to make it because I like coming to meetings because you give us hot chocolate. No, don't say that. <laughs> and sweeties! Oh. So how did you get involved in the Hankerton Knoll project? Uh, about two years ago, I saw you walking through Moyne Park. Okay, and then what happened? Uh, you gave me some leaflets and ever since then I've come, <laughs> I've come through a, a few of the projects. Uh -huh. Thanks, Hankerton Knoll no, project, no. <laughs> <laughs> I've been going to different youth clubs and projects for about... I'll keep them moving, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry? <laughs> okay. Oh, that's right.